This is a demo of Crystal Sphere, an interactive visualization system for big graphs. We demo the system on an IMDB movie graph. In this graph, movies are nodes and their shared actors are links. The graph is very dense and there are more than 40,000 links and 5,000 nodes. A density map provides an overview of the graph and gives guidance for users' exploration. Users can easily find the hotspots. Users can choose to show movie genres as node color. And the color legend is shown as a tag cloud. The system provides three levels of graph details. Level 1 is a graph overview with a density map. Level 2 details of each node. And level 3 are the details of the links. In part 2, we describe how users discover movie knowledge using the Crystal Sphere system. The user chooses to show movie genres as node colors. He wants to see Western movies, which are represented by the color red. He finds a group of these red nodes and can zoom in to see the details of those nodes. When a user hovers over a graph node, a poster of the movie is shown. A user can also click on a node to display its IMDb web page. And can watch the trailers. After finishing the western tour, the user zooms out and suddenly finds an island. This is very interesting, so he can zoom in to get more details. By hovering around, he found that this island is actually a group of Japanese movies. This makes sense because Japanese movies are less likely to use American actors, so the movie graph may consist of subgraphs of movies from different countries. The user then uses node colors to represent when the movie was created. Each color represents a decade. Movies produced between 1970 and 2010 seem to form a cluster in the graph. This seems to be an era of comedy and drama. Movies between 1920 and 1960 form another cluster. Drama and comedy are still popular, but romance is also popular. Therefore, romance belongs to the old days. Thank you for watching.